Naval Fleet expands its arsenal? Well, it's a combination of strategic planning, hefty budgets, and sometimes unexpected generosity. Picture this, the Philippine Navy, on its path to modernization, navigating through the complexities of upgrading its armada. Then, out of the blue, comes an unexpected gift. This surprise package is not just any token of friendship, but a significant boost to their maritime capabilities. Imagine the excitement, the sheer surprise when the news broke out. A donation of six Korean Pohang-class corvettes. These are not your everyday sea vessels, but warships designed for combat and patrol operations, equipped with anti-submarine warfare and anti-surface warfare capabilities. This generous offering hails from South Korea, a nation known for its advanced naval technology. The donation of these high-powered corvettes is no small matter. It's a game-changer, a force multiplier. It's akin to a chess player suddenly gaining six new queens on the board. But with this unexpected gift comes a tide of uncertainty. A gift that brought a wave of questions. Is the donation of this naval force still underway? Let's paddle back in time to trace the journey of this powerful donation. The tale begins in the year 2017, when initial discussions about the gift of six Korean Pohang-class corvettes to the Philippine Navy sparked. The following year, 2018, marked a significant milestone with the signing of the agreement. This was no ordinary pact, it was an emblem of military cooperation and mutual respect between the two nations. Moving forward to 2019, we witnessed the preparation for the transfer. It wasn't a simple handover. The process involved intricate logistical planning, skilled manpower, and significant resources. It was a testament to the dedication of both nations to strengthen their naval forces. The timeline however was not without its storms. As we sail into 2020, issues and delays began to surface. These ranged from technical challenges to global events that slowed down the process, yet the commitment remained unshaken, proving the resilience of this naval partnership. So after navigating through these events, where do we drop anchor today? Anchoring at the present, let's delve into the current status of this donation. The transfer of these six Pohang-class corvettes from Korea to the Philippines is indeed still in progress. The logistics of such a significant donation are complex and require time to fully execute. This isn't simply a case of handing over keys to a new car. Each vessel needs to be meticulously inspected, refurbished, and prepared for its new journey. The crews must also be rigorously trained to handle these state-of-the-art warships. As we speak, these intricate processes are taking place, ensuring the safety and efficiency of each corvette. The impact of this donation on the Philippine Navy is already being felt. With these additions to their fleet, the Navy's capabilities have significantly improved. They now have a stronger presence in regional waters, bolstering their defense and surveillance abilities. The Philippine Navy is gradually transforming into a more formidable naval force thanks to this generous donation. It's not just about the vessels themselves but also the knowledge and skills that come with them. This transfer is an investment in the future of the Philippine Navy, strengthening its capacity and resilience. So the journey of this naval force continues, shaping the seascape of the Philippine Navy.